What is up, guys? Making it up to you here now. <laughs> Even though times are rough, I gotta, I gotta do my stuff. So, um, was a little tight on money, so I doled my friend for twenty bucks. Of course, I beat him um, at work, which is funny. How to see other workers look at you like you're a nerd? But anyways, um, <laughs> behind or in front of my collector's album. I have um, something pretty cool for you guys today. Heard good stuff about it, um, so I'm going to give it a try and uh, see how it goes. Um, so a little something for you guys. Awesome booster pack. You can pick it up Toys R Us for 20 bucks. I wish I had a hundred bucks right now or else I would have picked out the five pack of, uh, of these guys here, which uh, increases my chances. But, um, yeah, so, here it goes, um, with the, uh, outer boxing, I'm just gonna get rid of the Konami, uh, shrink wrap here. Konami! Shrink wrap. Yeah, it's always nice when you have a knife on you, but some days you just don't have a knife. <laughs> but I do have scissors. Which will work. Snip the tip. Okay. So, get rid of a little bit of that glare on the case. So, bam. Nicely uh, designed box. Makes you look and feel pretty boss about this. Too bad you don't have enough room to store uh, your decks in here. Um, maybe you could if you have a deck of 50. Or so, you can probably just lay it in there, but, um, yeah. Pretty, pretty blinging. Um, so, as you know, it's, uh, three packs, five cards each per, per, uh, pack. And, uh, yeah. The King of Bling. Premium Gold includes some of the greatest hits from the old Gold Series set, adds a ton of new cards and introduces a new gold secret card rarity. Until now, gold cards have only been available through a limited number of stores, but premium gold will be available everywhere you can normally buy Yu-Gi-Oh! Cheat see trading card game. <laughs> gold rares for everyone. Gold rares are the king of bling, gold car card frames, gold card or uh, gold art box frames, gold text box frames, gold cards, names and for monsters, level, gold levels, rank stars. The new gold secret takes uh, takes all of that and adds secret rare cards, textured foil patterns on top of it. I guess this is what's called star rares or foil rares. Premium gold will be sold in small boxes, catch of which will contain three mini packs, each five cards. Team and Gold mini packs contain two gold secrets and three gold rares. Each gold secret will either be a brand new, never before seen card, or one of the legendary god cards from the original Yu-Gi-Oh! series. Yu-Gi-Oh! dot or slash card dot com 60 years and up. And it's recyclable. <clears throat> so anyways, um, flipping up the box, which is pretty cool too. You get uh, this nice feel, like opening like a treasure chest. Like just do-do-do-do. But anyways, like I said, you can probably store um, your uh, deck in here. Feel boss about it. But it's kind of weird to carry this thing around too. So, <clears throat> just getting out the pack for you guys. That's the rest of the box. Probably put that to the side there. And, um, these are the, uh, sets. They are all first edition, I forgot to tell you that. Probably saw it on the box, but, uh, yeah. Pretty, pretty nice. Though they are resellable. <laughs> Anyways, so, feels like it's been tampered with. <laughs> We're gonna open up the packs very carefully, maybe. 
Oh, no, not really. Wow. First one is uh, Dark Flare Dragon. Oh, wow. <laughs> Try Edge Levan. Levan. Sick. Ha! Ha ha ha! Ha! How about that, guys? Uh, <laughs> Slifer the Sky Dragon out of the first one I get. That's, that's remarkable. That's amazing. Holy crap. Okay. That's a good pack. Oh my god. <laughs> Followed by Traps Done, Boston, and, um, uh, Breaker the Magical Warrior. I have this card, but not in Foil Hollow, so, or Hollow whatsoever so that's nice wow wow slither <laughs> uh, my first pull um what used to be is that the the originals had a color to them like uh slither was red obviously uh raw was a little bit more yellow and blue was obelisk and now they kind of hit it so if you don't have sleeves you're good to go with this card oh my god <laughs> Oh wow. My might have uh, soiled myself a bit there. <laughs> Note self, these cards have not been tempered with whatsoever, even though they feel like uh they're not packet squares. Oh look at that. That was a Boston pull. Um <laughs> didn't rip the packaging. Um anyways, continuing on, we have fire formation. Um I think this is Tenki. Pretty cool. Ugh, that glare. Cormanly Guardian Knot. And then we have number 31. I can't even read that. <laughs> Embodiment of Punishment. Okay, number thirty-one embodiment of punishment. That's that's cool. Necro Gardener and Gold Sarcophagus. How about that? That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Next one we have. So happy about that Slither. Oh, that makes me happy. That was not a waste of money, though. <laughs> ah, okay. <clears throat> As we toss all the cards to the side, we have Solar Recharge, number 82, Heartland Wag Wag Heartland Draco. That's a cute and adorable little card. I'm gonna read all these later. Gimmick Puppet. Another gold sarcophagus. Oh. And Caius the Shadow Marnik, uh, Monarch. I have uh, the uh, original uh, deck edition in my uh, box here. so Or box uh, binder. So this will be a nice addition to him. Oh wow. That is a lot cooler than mine though. Okay. Loving it. Loving it guys. I'll be getting some more cards two weeks from now, so be sure to check out my channel. Um, what got me back into this was uh, Simply Unlucky and uh, a couple of my workmates uh, saying uh, that they uh, play Yu-Gi-Oh, so I started building my deck again. But wow. Oh my god, I'm in love with that. <laughs> Alright, after that, that's it guys. Peace. Mwah.